it is what it do to be like everybody it's your girl michi and i'm back with another video so today i'll be packaging orders as you can tell so we're just gonna get into it this is my it was all a dream shirt there's a timmy logo on the back i'm just laying it down flat face down and i'm going through like the folding process of it if you guys want to see the folding process on that you can go to the video linked right here and it'll show you the full step-by-step -step process of me folding the shirt and how I do that. All right, so this is how my packages look. I mainly fold to where you can see the design on the front. So right when you open it, you see the design. So right now I'm putting it in a clear bag because I want it to look professional. I want it to look nice, you know, and if you want to see a hack or what I use for that, I'll link this video right here in the corner where I show you what bag I use, where I get them from and how you can get them cheap. Now I am going through my thank you cards and looking for her name. These are what my thank you cards look like. Um, I already pre-handwritten uh, what the thank you cards look like on the back with their name and the personalized letter on how to take care of the shirt afterward. But I'm just sliding that now into the front. I make sure I put it to where you can see it right when you open the shirt. Also, I'm taking two business cards that I got from Vistaprint and those are my business cards. I'm just putting those in the package as well. I put it on the part where, you, where the design is so they can clearly see it when they open the shirt. Um, I had to go get my stickers, but this is what my stickers look like. It says, Timmy, thanks I made it. I could show you guys if you want to see a video on that, on how I made my stickers myself. But this is what I use to seal the bag up. So I just fold the bottom part of the bag where the shirt doesn't fit. And then I just put the sticker on the side to seal the bag up. Push down to make sure all the air is out of it. And then my package is done. Now here, these next orders, I'm just gonna speed through, but this is my Shea Butter Baby and Individual Powerpuff Girl shirt. I'm just gonna show you these shirts and now for all the rest of the packaging, it's just gonna be a sped up process. I'm pretty much doing the same thing that I do with every shirt, so it's not really much to talk about. So enjoy the video. If you guys didn't know, as you can see, I make taller shirts as well. This is a Afro girl shirt, but since it is a taller shirt, it says Afro baby on the shirt. But yeah, you can check my taller section out in the link in the description below. TimmyClothing.com. Shop with me. Okay, so these right here are custom ordered hoodies. 
this girl asked me to make two hoodies with a picture of her and her boyfriend on the front and i think it's his football number on the back but these are custom hoodies that she paid for uh, i'm not really going to show a real full in depth of these because i'm not sure she want me to show all of that but yeah i do do custom orders as well the, the custom orders you have to dm me on my business page to get those i do not have it like on my website or anything but yeah so i'm just packaging the two custom hoodies his was an extra large and hers was a medium <laughs> So now what I'm doing is I'm just stacking all the orders up. So I put them in this teal poly mailer right here. And I did the teal because it matches, you know, my brand. My brand color is that. So we're just going with that. Okay. Okay. But what I'm doing right now is I'm just folding it up. This one is an in-hand order. So what I do with in-hand orders is I write their name um, on a, what is it, like a label sticker and yeah that's what i'm doing now just writing it and putting it in the bottom corner so i know who to give it to you know so i can just keep track of whose package is whose <laughs> Now with orders that need to get shipped out, what I do is I write the name and the order number on the package and I just throw it to the side because then I'll be able to log into my uh, Shopify um, website and find their, you know, the shipping label and address and all of that and print that out later. So right here, I'm just, you know, getting myself ready to make a thumbnail for this video. But I wanted to say thank y'all so much to everybody who purchased. I really appreciate it. I've been growing so fast. I really appreciate it a lot. Like I always say, subscribe, subscribe down below. Like this video, comment what you want to see next. And hit the notification bell so you'll be notified every time that I post. Hope y'all enjoyed this video. Bye. You know. You know.